It's being called one of the largest cash heists in LA history. Curious, let's go out to Gigi Graciette in Silmar, where burglars broke into the vault of a money storage facility. They got away with a lot of money, Gigi. And as you said, Brooke, this seems like something out of a movie, a Mission Impossible movie. Take a look at the video. This is all happening here in Silmar on Easter Sunday. An estimated $30 million stolen in cash from a Silmar money storage facility. The burglars reportedly breaking in either through the side of the building or the roof and then managing to open up a vault where the cash was being stored without triggering any of the sophisticated alarms. Arms. And the burglary crew was so stealth and meticulous that no one noticed the money was gone until Monday when employees opened up the vault, which showed no obvious signs of a break-in. Now, the company is Garda World. They have branches around the world and over 132,000 employees. And they specialize in cash services, which includes ATM services and armored truck transports. According to their website, some of their clients are Fortune 500 companies, even the United States federal government, along with other international government agencies. And reportedly, not everyone who works at this facility knew that that much money was being stored here. The place is pretty secured. Uh, alarm system, they check to make sure that the alarm is set up. So, you know, just to think that they were able to go through the security system and get away with all that money, it's, uh, it's a shocker. Now, that was a Garda World employee who asked that we not identify him. Again, they managed to somehow go around that alarm system. And, of course, that's something both the FBI and the LAPD are looking at right now. And, of course, they always, as in most crimes, start with those closest to the crime. And that would be looking at the employees. Reporting live, I'm Gigi Graciette. Back to you. All right, Gigi, thank you.